Come on. Oh, you got a cap, sucker. Hey, this thing is on point. Look, the it's pretty good. Ooh, Uzi. You bastard, take that. And it is time. What up, gamers? Did you know that you can play your favorite Xbox games through your iPhone, iPad, or any of your favorite iOS devices? Well, I'm going to show you guys that today. I'm going to show you all of the settings on how to set it up using Remote Play. That's right, Xbox now has Remote Play, and you can play it on your iPhone. So let's get into it. I'm going to show you guys the settings right now. All right, so first off, I want you to log into your Xbox and then go to the settings. Scroll down to Devices and Connections. Go to the right, and you're going to see Remote Features. Click on that. And now you want to enable Remote Features. Boom, enable that. Testing your setup. Test your might. Test your might. Oh! Come on, you piece of crap. An hour later. Okay, so update your controller, it says. Um, I guess update the controller. Let's do it. And what you want to do is uh, go to this dot 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 thing right here, right? Then it says right here firmware version. And then it says update now. So click on that to update and update now. Updating. Keep the controller motionless and turned on. Um, we're just going to fast forward to this. All right. Update is complete. It's saying to close. This only took a few minutes. And we're good here, I believe. You can configure it if you want. I'm just gonna keep it at this default. Press B to go back. And this beaker glass thing, you know, it just shows you all the buttons if you wanna press it and test it out. Then press these double buttons to exit. And then I'm just gonna press B to go out. And there we go. Remote features are enabled. Let's go and install it onto our phone. Boom, all right, so next up, we're gonna go to our phone and then go to the app store and search for Xbox here. X b -b 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 box b -b 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 box and then you're gonna have to sign in or set one up you know I'm gonna sign into my account right now once you use live to sign in continue okay once I'm signed in it says let's get you set up manage your console and connect with friends all in one place next have a new console set it up now uh, all right set up our console enter the code on your TV uh, what code Okay, I didn't see any code, so I believe it's this upper right icon right up here on the app. So I'm going to cl click on that right here, remote play on this device. Okay, let's do it. Let's turn it this way. I believe it's going to do landscape. All right, check your network connection. We found your console, but can't connect. Try from a different Wi-Fi. You son of a... Ah! I'm going to go back here. TV, AV, power settings. Let me check out my settings here. All right, when Xbox turns on, send on. I'm going to turn everything on here. So see, I'm in my device power options. And when the, it's saying TV, when Xbox turns on, send on. Let's go back. Xbox app preferences right here. Allow play to streaming. Allow game streaming to other devices. Allow connections from any device. That's what we have. Okay, so I think I should be good with that. And let's go back here and try to connect again. Boom, look at that. Keanu Reeves has started playing remotely. And connect a controller. You need to connect a support controller via USB or Bluetooth to play. Okay, so it looks like I'm going to have to pair up this Xbox controller to my phone. And to pair it up, you have to press this pairing button on the Xbox. You got to hold that in. And then see, it says Xbox wireless controller. I'm going to pair it up to my phone. And there it is, it is paired up right here. Xbox wireless controller connected. Now I'm gonna go back to the Xbox here, just like that, and I believe it should be connected. It's gonna allow me to control my console from this phone now. Here it is, look at the screen, guys. All right, take a look at this, guys, look. I am controlling, look at that, remotely. It's working on the screen right here too with the remote, and on the phone, they are, in sync with each other. But I wonder how much lag it's gonna have. 
So we're gonna jump into some war zone on <laughs> the phone right now. This is gonna be insane. All right, guys, check this out. I start up war zone. We are in zombie royale. I'm gonna do a quick game right now, showing you guys the remote play on this, and it's looking pretty good. Check it out. It's uh, I did notice a little bit of lag and some wonkiness. It was like disconnecting, reconnecting on the remote play initially, but it hasn't done it in this game yet. And we're gonna see how the gameplay is right now. So I can connect my headphones to my iPhone right now if I want. If I want to get like really good audio while I'm playing. But let me just land down here and I'm watching my iPhone right now as I'm playing to see how smooth the remote play is because I'm I'm kind of worried about that with the lagness. Let's see here. Wow, it's pretty good. It's pretty responsive. I am surprised with this remote play right now, guys. This is badass. I'm watching my iPhone screen right now. I'm not even watching my main screen. And it is not bad. Let's see how well I do here. Come on, zombie scum. Come and get it. I wonder if, like, my friend can give me access. <laughs> if he has an Xbox and I'm like, hey, let me play on my phone. And I'm over somewhere else, you know? And I just connect my controller to it. I wonder if I can do that. Oh, let me get this. Bastards right outside. You bastard, take that. Oh, no, I don't want to use that. Come on, switch. Oh, man. Zombie. Woohoo! Some guys. Oh, they're right over there. Oh, look. I lost connection. Look at this. Please reconnect your controller. What? No. So, that's how remote play is, guys. Like I said, it's a little bit janky. Come on. Are you serious? And it booted me out. All right, all right, this is for you Fortnite fans. I'll also play Fortnite on here and show you guys how it's playing. Okay, let's just do some team rumble. Let's do a quick one right here, show you guys how it's playing. And it's looking pretty slick. Uh, uh, uh. And here we are. Let's see how, how much lag there is on this. Pretty smooth. It's looking good. Let's just jump down and slaughter some bodies. Uh, 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 uh. Where the haters at? Where the haters at? I'm gonna put a big cap in the back of your big ass. Hey, Rocket. How you doing back there, Rocket? Yeah, look at this, guys. It looks very smooth on the iPhone right now. It is awesome. Who is shooting me right now? Who are you shooting, buddy? Who are you shooting? Hello? Who are you shooting? You don't want any of this. Eat it up, yeah. Oh, I hear someone. Oh, there he is. Die, scum. <laughs> ah! Surprise, motherfucker! Woo! Luckily, I ate that fish. It helped out a lot. So yeah guys, this is Fortnite on the iPhone again, using remote play on the Xbox. So if you still wanna play it, you know? It's kind of a weird way to play it on your iPhone again, but that's how you do it. Geronimo! I hope you guys enjoyed this quick little um, demonstration of the Xbox remote play. And I will see you guys again next time, right? Hopefully. Ah, oh crap. That's a slaughter. Oh, 
fun. Oh, you got a cap, sucker. That's how you do it. I'm out of here. Wee! I'll see you guys later. Peace. Oh, we got cap again, sucker. I'm out of here. Yeah, we are number one. Woohoo!